<laughs> hey, welcome back to another episode of The Final Stop. I'm your host, Daniel Bridgegad. We're in the midst of a light-skin summer. Sitting to my right, the Vampire King, Lord Meerkat, Tristan Bullock. Hi. What does light skin summer mean? We are in the I'll, we're in the midst of a light skin summer. I don't think you, you can, know what you I can, don't I don't think you know what mid You can means. feel the dampness. I don't think in he the knows air. what light skin means. Are you saying the mist of a light skin? What do you think minced means? Mists. 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 Of a, over here on the side oh table. Oh my god. <laughs> Tequila stepdad, Daniel Bridgehead <laughs> over here. <laughs> That's fucking fire. Over here on the side table, it's big and brody, Brody Asbill and Andrew. Horiana. I need to start rolling the R on that. Andrew, Horiana. Hey, what's up, guys? What's up, babe? Okay. All right. Is that not how you actually pronounce your name? No. Is there a, there's not a rolled R? No. If you went back to the home, to the motherland, they don't pronounce it with a rolled R? If anything, the the Y in the middle is what gets rolled. Horiana. You mean the two L's? Okay, so you're really you're, you're fighting me on where the R gets rolled, and yes. there's a rolled R somewhere in there. And who's in the corner, Daniel? Damn, all right. Fuck. Over here in the fucking corner. It's Aldo Compact. Compan, Compagna. Yeah, the you little got, squiggly, yeah. got the little squiggly line. In Enye, thank you. Enye, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> That's <laughs> racist. I took Spanish That's for three years. Is. That's the only That's thing I took called. from it. Is yeah. There's an Enye. Oh man, dude, Jesus Christ. Uh, I don't understand the hostility. I was just trying to joke and have fun with everyone, and you're like, on to the next thing. Oh no, I just want to make sure you always forget about Aldo. I started drinking light color liquor one time, and you get on my ass about being able to not do. This my is job the second correctly. time. And I wasn't drunk the first time. Nobody was drunk the first time. You were time. fucking hammered. You were Shut hammered. your... Destroyed, dude. All right. I was a little buzzed the last time. <laughs> dude, you were hammered. Do you know... You don't know how to defend yourself when someone's hammered. Can I be honest with you? What happened this morning? Dude. Okay. So I came out. I told my girlfriend last night, hey, we should work out in the morning. And then I forgot all about that. And I woke up at about 8 o'clock and I was like, I kind of just want to drink a Modelo right now. Maybe play a little video games, which I know is not... The right answer. I'm aware of this. That's not a right answer for anybody. It's shut up. It's a right answer for me. Yeah. <laughs> so I wake up and I drink a Modelo and I hit. I mean, an egregiously big dab, like irresponsibly big. Yeah. And, and then she comes out in fucking workout clothes and is like, "So, so what time are we leaving?" I was like, "What?" Yeah. I would rather suffer through a workout being off a weird buzz that I didn't want than have to be like. Here's the thing. We can't work out because I smacked a beer and took a dab and then have to Oh, get... this was post-beer smacking? And that was, yeah, it was this morning after I smacked a beer and was like, this is going to be a great morning. She comes out and was like, we're working out. And I was like, mm, yes, exactly. Because I'm not going to tell you what actually happened. Yeah. For being real, tucked a beer behind that plant over there. It was like... <laughs> You're a C. I literally it's see still it. There. It's still there. <laughs> you were the John Wick of alcoholism. This is everywhere there's a hidden beer. Look mm. at this. Look at this. Look at this. Dude, like, Everything in here damn. is just false wood. You, <laughs> you touch it once and there's like a compartment. It's, it's that like opens. that thing was like, is it cake or is it fucking furniture? And it's like Depending on what part of the house you're in, it could be Modelo or Miller time. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Did you watch that show? Is it cake? No. Oh, it's we've lost. That's AI is winning. AI, they've already taken control and they're just taking victory. I they're just, high stepping on the way to <laughs> world domination. I just, like, if this is a track meet, they're backwards. Let's running. get these skin bags to pay attention for literally 45 minutes on whether or not mi a microphone is cake. I can imagine if we leave the room like all of us for like 10 minutes, we come back and everything's eaten just because we watched a show with Andrew and he's like, I could have sworn to try. I, I mean, could have sworn most of these things were cake. Yeah, he's still kind of <laughs> sucking on a microphone. Yeah, he knows it like, isn't cake. And he's like, just so you know, guys, nothing in here. Is I there. taste the frosting. At least I promise. <laughs> this is black licorice. You can't tell me <laughs> otherwise. Guys, I've deduced most of the things in here aren't cake. I have a lab coat on and everything. <laughs> it's like a science experiment. Yeah. I'm just eating everything. You just open the fridge and there's a deduced. full cake in there. You're like, I'm saving that thing for the end. That's my tester. That's my palate cleanser. Yeah, that's my palate cleanser. You just yeah. go back just like, yeah, that's cake. That's cake. <laughs> go back to eating the oven. <laughs> Dude, don't, don't, what's your, uh, I'm not, I'm not good with self-control either. I'm going to ride these genetics till the wheels fall off, but make no mistake, I don't take care Speaking of. Speaking of self-control, Tristy boy turning a new leaf. Oh, this is a big deal, actually. Yeah, yeah. No more Tristy. No more drunk Tristy. I'm uh, quit, first of all, I've quit there drinking. should have never been a Tristy. Stop calling yourself Tristy. I don't like that. You did it first, motherfucker. You brought it into this Pantheon. Boy. You, you said T-Bone Tristy. Boy. Or T-Dog. I've heard him call himself Tristy boy multiple times, and you can't tell me I'm lying. Little T-Bird over here. <laughs> uh, 
A little Teagle, a little Teagle. Flapped his wings on sobriety. Yeah, a little, little Tristan. Uh, no booze till. Bum, bum. Brooklyn. No, I'm uh, not drinking for like a year. Like a year, probably a year and a half. Damn. Just figuring can I ask it you, out. Can I ask you a question? Why is, why is there that limitation on it? Because if you're not going to drink for a year, why not just stop drinking? Well, the thing is, like, I'm not going to drink for, like, that's my, like, I'm going to see, like, year, year and a half. And I'm like, I'm probably just going to keep on not drinking. But I just want to see, like, just set, like, at least one goal. Just, like, once I hit a year and I'm like, all right, then we can fucking, I'm just going to continue on. Or, like, just, I'm probably just going to keep on doing it. Like, okay. It's an achieve- achievable yeah. goal to get you started. Though. Yeah, I'm, like, three, I'm, like, fucking three days down. Question. What? Did you not that I'm not, not saying not, like obviously going a year without drinking sick, but did you not think about maybe setting like smaller goals that you can achieve on the way to a year? Like let's get to a week, let's get to a month. Well, of course I'm taking it day by day and shit like that. Like, dude, when I first like the first two days, Referuski, I got like heavy shakes. I like just started to even out, but I'm still shaking. Uh, fucking. <laughs> He's shaking out at work. Here's your chicken cordon bleu. And he's like yeah, fucking he, No, for real, for real. Like putting on <laughs> stickers on club sandwiches. I'm like, ah, ah, ah. And I'm like, it's my Ritalin. I'm not an alcoholic. Bing, bing, bing. Like, I, think uh, that, no. I, I guess that's good, right? Because like that's... You were drinking a decent amount. You told me a little bit before the cast the amount that you were drinking. Yeah, I, mean, I was that's drinking. Probably, that's probably not... Seltzies. These hard Seltzies. They trick you. A.K.A. They trick. road sodas. Road soda. Road sodies <laughs> are... I heard my uncle call, call them road sodas for the first time before I heard it in comedy, and it was very concerning. I was like, that's <laughs> not... There shouldn't be a cute word for, like, glitzing up drinking and drinking. I've heard, like, roadies. Dude, like, literally, most of the time, I'd be like, if I've had, like, a minute where I haven't cleaned my car... The road sodi amount, like literally, I could go up to a homeless man and just be like, "Do you want like forty dollars in recyclables?" <laughs> you would keep them in the car. Oh yeah, just under my seat. And, and I've definitely driven. With, I've had. It a sounded road. like I had a fully loaded pinball machine in the back <laughs> of my car. Just like the amount of like. <laughs> just playing Mrs. You just sound pinball like you're on the weight of like medieval times. You have knight's armor in your car. No, dude. Sir, no. is there chainmail anywhere? <laughs> yeah. in this the thing car? is, now I got these. These Topo Chico grapefruits. Shouts out! I'm gonna get sponsored. Why don't you day. just uh, slide into a nice Odul? Or a Heineken Zero? No, I don't. Why would I just give well, myself all, liquid farts? Why do I want that? He doesn't. He already doesn't drink beer. Like he's. Like, not I a beer didn't guy. drink. I didn't drink beer. I only drank hard alcohol and like hard mm. seltzers, yeah. which one is a lot harder than the other. Uh, but like I fucking would just like Way I to got break this out during a uh, right around the time I start getting into tequila. Way to just be like, yeah, I was drinking too much. No, literally when problem. you're it's, it's literally, literally when the you... universe balancing itself. He's like, Tristan's not drinking. We have to turn Daniel into a massive alcoholic. You oh, you're see, downward you spiral. spiral. Oh, you, I would love. Actually, you guys probably like me more when I drink. Yeah. I'm a lot nicer. I don't like you any time of day. <laughs> Just to be clear, I hate your fucking cuss. To be fair, there's very few times where I find you enjoyable. It's when you're <laughs> extremely hammered in a comedy setting and when you turn into a white woman. Which is great, where you just like will say something and then just laugh to yourself and like cover your face. And I'm just like, Daniel, who are you right now? You're just like, my name's Tiffany. I love, like, I love, I love, I, <laughs> fuck off. When I when I drink, when you go full Daniela in the club. Is in there with your fucking. Bro, Daniela's a bad bitch. Don't get shit with twisted around Neop- her. With, with your right? Neapolitan thirty-five dollar drink, just sitting there, just being like, "Oh my god." We did. Well, I took Andrew to. Uh, I'm to gonna flights. get pregnant by a Cardinals player. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care if he's third string. He's making the team. Oh my god, is that him? He's on the bench. Is that him? He doesn't have CTE, so he won't hit me too hard, man. That's. Okay. <laughs> I've, I've been trying to really. I've been trying to really up my uh, my adult level. I went out and I got. I bought some adult like beverage glasses because before like I, I have mason jars or whatever that we drink shit out of but I so you got some, some like, money and you're doing alcoholism like a professional <laughs> isn't that kind of weird that money is the only thing that if it affects your day-to-day life is the only thing that makes you in society's eyes an alcoholic if you have the funds to support it you're what constitutes being Bert Kreischer by no means if he made forty thousand dollars a year they would have shoved his ass down multiple AA meetings and figured out what the fuck was going on. Oh, yeah. Well, but they he's did, on a world tour. Well, they did. That's why Sober October started. That's a fun gimmick for money. It but was that's not the, only, the first year. No, no. They, no, I well, mean, not like, the first year. They're bringing it back this year. They are bringing it back. As a fun gimmick yeah. for money. Yeah. Are they really? Yeah, Is it like bringing it back. Netflix filming it or something? No, no, no. no. Arshafir posted about it like coming this October against my will or something. Like, it's the same guys. Sigura, oh. Kreischer, all them. That's fun. I don't know if I could go. Here's a I 
this is I'm probably addicted to weed for being real. I could definitely stop drinking. I don't I don't know if I could go like a long period of out time a long period of time without smoking. No, I'll cause. scream racial slurs at a stranger These without God marijuana. Damn. <laughs> Say it. No. <laughs> Say it. Say it. In the privacy of your I don't own know. car. No if one I had can to go hear for you. I think the longest I've gone in like recent memories, maybe like three or four days. Without and, weed? Yeah, and that's because we were up at yeah, wifey's, I wifey's parents' house. Yeah, I can't Which I still got bitched at about uh-huh. that it smelled like weed up there. It's fine. I tried to be real nice, get a pen. By, by our parents or? Just when, when we left, they were like, it smells like uh, it smells a little bit of weed up here. I was like, what, what, did, why, what do they know about smelling like weed, dude? Yeah. Well, the dad they're, eats edibles. They're hot boxes Pops in that house. Pops, How dare eat, they? Pops eating edibles for sure. Uh, yeah, yeah. Possibly. What if you sure. like use like? Oh, I want to show you the real me. Who the fuck is calling me? No. Um. Because uh, <laughs> 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 it, it you guys see who it was. Was it Shannon? <laughs> no, no. I'll Dude, call- bleep this out, and I'll cover my mouth. It was. <laughs> okay, I get it. You don't have to keep trying to say it. That's gonna be a long ass fucking bleep, dude. I get it. I heard it. <laughs> just the way you glance that. and we're like absolutely not there's no, no I, good to come i from. mean no i mean kind of in the middle of a thing right now yes. uh, i just felt the couch vibrating and i'm like that's annoying let me put a butt in that i yeah. see you know tristan's sober he's not going to take a phone call in the middle of the cast that's good <laughs> i do like that i like you so your eyes are open a little bit more <laughs> I'm awake. I'm alert. <laughs> I don't I, think you want me this alert, Daniel. It's now. It's now. I cons- think you're gonna start dripping fucking tequila into this just to kind of. You don't want me sharp on edge. You don't want me. <laughs> Cosby and you just a little bit. Yeah, you don't want me ready to oh. fucking. I'm, I'm throwing. I'm throwing the top. What are those called? The uh, Topo Chico. Topo Chico. I'm just ripping those labels on and throwing them on Heinekens and being like, here, bro, fucking have a have a good day. I oh yeah okay thanks oh uh, no I mean like to be fair I I was literally thinking about that the other day if you just guys were fucking around with me and get, like poured like hey here's water I'd be like I'd be mad but I would I'd just be like oh all right that's happened that would to be me a more very than, very fun experiment that if happened we, that's happened to me more than one occasion when I was like you're hammered dude you need to drink water and it's just a full glass no of I'm not even saying that like where you're hammered like where you have a guy who's like I'm trying to stop drinking. And we replace his what he thinks is that with something he clearly knows there's alcohol in. Watching him make the decision to just be like, I'm not going to say anything about this, and just keep and just keep drinking it. Or would you? Or would you be like, guys, come on? What, so what your are we so, doing? your social experiment is ruining somebody's <laughs> life. Yeah. Wow. Someone just like <laughs> for entertainment. Guy, I replaced his insulin with heroin. <laughs> oh my God. Let's see if he gets back on the horse. Let's see. Be a, let's be a Jewish thing. Just dosing people. It runs in our blood. Bro. Yeah, you and Shafir. Tell me that's not. What fun, do you though. think about Kobe? He's all right. Oh, well. I'm a Spurs guy. He's he beat better us a couple times. Better than what he fucking said about. Him. <laughs> that to me is weird, bro. People who just like actively troll like that. And not that it's not funny, but it's just like that's weird that that's what gets you off. Like, just act, just actively like you actively have ruffling an inflate- feathers. Are you talking about like online? I was about to say you yeah. actively I have mean, like I'm, an inflated uh, ego. I do that every single day. I'm not gonna lie Troll to you. People? When when I had my old podcast, a lot of fun. How's that going? It's pretty good, right? We're bringing it back. <laughs> yeah. Pretty, oh God! <laughs> Please do not. Internal affairs. Terrible <laughs> idea. Terrible idea. <laughs> Oh no! But um, what the fuck are these topics this week? Um, oh yeah, we were talking about this outside because I'm fucking hungry as shit. We're definitely getting some munch in between this and the IA. But um, some munch, some munch, dude. Forty four is right down the street. What do you mean forty four? Sugar. It's called sugar forty four. Oh, that. Have you ever been there? That. All right. So there's a a fucking strip club called Sugar Forty Four right next to a McDonald's. Yeah. So it. Yeah, it's like a and Mc- a Wells Fargo. To be fair. Yeah. It's, imagine going to the Wells Fargo to get money to go to strip. Like, dude, you can have a whole that night. No. Sweet. Imagine running into a stripper you just paid. No, no, no. Not even that. Back here's and forth. Some, here's the real scenario of what happened. Like these things are all built very strategically. It's a guy who doesn't have a lot of money. So he doesn't want to buy food inside the strip club because that's expensive. Yeah, so he, he stops goes at Wells Fargo. Mc- they're all in perfect order. Yeah. You go in McDonald's first, you get your food. You eat that. You then go to Wells Fargo because the fucking fee that they have on the strip club ATM is egregious. Literally like 12 bucks. Yeah. So I've heard. And then that guy does At Sugar 44 specifically? So I've heard specifically at Sugar 44. <laughs> so I've heard allegedly. And you walk in there and that's a that's a 
heathens, che- a broke man's, way, a poor man's way. Dude, if you you're, will. dude, that I have you know from the outside, that strip club looks like the cantina from Star Wars. It's it, just bricks. Exactly. That's every strip club. No, it's no. Ju- no. It's it's literally allegedly. Just, it, no, <laughs> allegedly. <laughs> allegedly uh, no, it's like a know. sunburnt sugar forty four sign, and it has like these like faux fucking pillars out front. Have you ever been to a strip club? Yeah. Only oh, one Tristan, now. you uh, want to talk about that story? Whoa, did oh, you guys yeah. go to a strip club together? Yeah. It yeah, was the first one. time. Did I Andrew get titty fucked? Tell me right now. No, it, it was the first time. I think you went to a strip club. It's the club. first time I'd ever been to a strip club. It was after uh, El Charo. And we, although, no, you didn't, you weren't there. No, he hadn't started comedy. But you can yeah. get in, though. You can get into a strip club. Patreon. I don't we take I Aldo to, to a strip, strip club. club. <laughs> he could only go to fully nude ones, though, because he's 18 Why would plus. you go to a 21 and up one? Be, I mean, like. Why would you want? Why would you go to a twenty-one and up one? Yeah. So uh, usually, so you can drink. Yeah. There's the eighteen the and eighteen ups, up. They're, they're all new. You don't think he's showing drink. up hammered? He's the mezcal menace. All right. Yeah, he's showing up with a thermos. <laughs> I'm here to stroke your clay. Yeah, yeah. You're sure. <laughs> Whoa, gross. You gotta- <laughs> it's a joke. It's a joke. It is, is a public- joke. Is this the public episode? This is the public episode. These are absolutely jokes. <laughs> yeah. This is a comedy podcast. Yeah. <laughs> you are so <laughs> fucked. And uh, time stamp that? Hey, Taylor. <laughs> uh, I'm joking. I don't need to go to a strip club, dude. I live off 27th. I just got to drive down the street. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Have you ever picked? Have you ever paid for it? No, I've never paid for a hooker. But you're, I'm always going home. You're 18. Like, That'd be very concerning. If you were like, yeah, dude. I'm yeah, already paying for time pussy. Spring. Time, time's up, dude. Game's over. I'm 18. I don't. I have a girlfriend. Life's going pretty good have for me right now. Have you ever paid for pussy? Yeah. What? <laughs> no Why hesitation. No, no, no. He does a joke about it. Uh, yeah. Are you dead ass? Where? Yeah, Mexico. I, I no, not in Mexico. It was Mexican food. It, it was Mexican I, woman. I got that mixed up. <laughs> <laughs> Mexican woman in downtown Phoenix. Oh, you paid for an American piece of pussy. It was a strip. It was a stripper at a strip club. How, how so much did you pay? Was it? Wait, the. Mm, how, how many times have you been to a strip club? Since? Was it? Mm-hmm. I, I, immediately after that, I stopped going. After the one that we went to. No, I went one more time, and that's when it happened. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. I yeah, talked yeah. about on the coconut cucks. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. yeah, having very uncomfortable car sex. No, no, no. It was in like a bro. You got the perfect dimensions for like a Camry doggy style session, <laughs> dude. You need you need to imagine you showing up with like one of those Sprinter vans. Just like just just amateur bang bus full stripper pole in the yeah van. yeah no you're just like so she can get on top. Just like so, you just be like, I need to be road. <laughs> yeah, get in the sprinter. No, yeah, I I went to a strip club by myself, which was already a red flag on well, my you part. Went there by yourself, yeah, because I was like, yeah, it's gonna yeah, be yeah. as fun as when I went with a group, and it was not. We'll talk off air about that. Uh, I've been, I'm very curious. It about was what it's so like to funny, go to club. dude. When we went to the strip club together, I w- there was like glass in the private dance room, and I watched him get a lap dance, and I just was looking at him, and he kept looking no! at me, and no, I no, just no, was making eyes. Eye- no, 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 no. You, it wasn't through the class. We were oh, in the yeah, same yeah, yeah. room. Oh yeah, you guys yeah. are both getting lap dances. Yeah. yeah, and I was looking at, I was looking at Andrew, and I was just like, you "Whose girl was hotter?" I wasn't even looking at her. I was looking at Andrew. I looked up and I made <laughs> Andrew, it. Andrew, yeah. Andrew, whose girl? Was <laughs> yeah, Trish's girl's a cave troll. That's all that told me. I, I don't give a shit. I was looking at Andrew. I was just like, <laughs> "You have a boner right now." He was, you have he, a boner. He was busy pulling off belly button rings. So Lord Farquaad's throwing. Oh it back yeah, on and Tristan. then the meanwhile, I wasn't pulling off belly button rings. She had a very loose belly button. Why are we? talking about that. No, <laughs> this is mean, interesting. He I'm was, yeah, he was no. playing it with, with it like a toy. <laughs> <laughs> one of the door stoppers. Yeah. It was my first time I've ever been to one of those. So I was How old like, were you? I was like, it was like a year ago. It was like a year and a half to... No, it was like Get almost, the numbers right. It was year almost and a half like, ago. A year and a half ago. <laughs> I was about to say like Sorry, a year. Haley. Happy birthday, by the way. <laughs> no, no. It was definitely like a year and a half ago. a year ago. and a half ago, yeah. It was definitely at a time where I'm covered, for sure. It was It was like... It was. It was before my birthday. It was before October. Yeah, it was before my birthday for sure. I mean, do you want to draft this up in a legal document? Jesus Christ. No, it doesn't I just matter re- when it happened. I remember because was that the night that we had to get fucking Ricky's. Yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We had yeah, to get yeah, Rick, uh, Ricky's, Ricky's car. Like, no, the, Ricky's. The dog fu- was like in Ricky's no, car. No, Ricky's fucking. Uh, it was her dickhead roommate. Her dickhead roommate. He made up all that shit up about Ricky. It was all his problem. It was, and he just like made everyone fucking hate Ricky for the night. It sucked. That's in. I get that's inside baseball. But. What like I can't imagine. So you're saying. So did you have a good time at the strip club? I guess is my question. It was, it was weird. Like it was like a weird. Was that your first time? Paying for sex? 
or being at a strip club. So, okay, take me through this. So you paid for sex, but did you go in there thinking you were about to pay for some pussy? Or no. you went in there thinking you were about to have a good time? Yeah. Because all these girls offer pussy, just so you know. Yeah. No, they don't. Some are fine, upstanding individuals who no, are just trying not. to pay yeah. their way through they college. All, so how, how they is all the process, process of her Some asking. are just fine, upstanding. But you know what? If I you're, qualify if, them all as if sex you're workers. Already, if you're already, there's a number that's going to get you up. And, and the numbers, by the way, not that much. If $300. There's a num- right. If there's a number that's going to get you up on the pole and show your tits and pussy... There's also another number that's not that far away that's going to get you to ride this dick. That's exactly what happened. We, yeah. I, I went for a lap dance and she was like, hey, $300 and we'll go into a, a different room. And There's nothing wrong like, with what? it. Do you, mean just 10, do you mean 10 rounds from a Barrett 50 cal? Absolutely. Are you kidding <laughs> cook, me? Cook. Yeah. You shot one round into a stranger. Instead, you had 10 seconds up. Okay, so, so you paid her for the lap dance, which was how much? It was uh, 40 bucks. Normal, normal pricing. Okay. And then you went to the VIP room, or the, it was a lap dance at public. It was, it was so they have like this side VIP. Like Where was VIP this at? Room. What club? Uh, uh, Abco. Okay. Or yeah, American American yeah Alaskan Bush Company. Yeah. Okay. And then uh, so we went, we got a lap dance in like the you little said side it, room. Like, sorry, you said you said Alaskan Bush Company. Like it's like it's stock number. Um, <laughs> like, yeah, I was like gonna you let that slide. The, tick, the ticker tape. Because yeah, yeah. But just so you know, most people don't know the abbreviation yeah, Abco. Did, did, right? What did Abco <laughs> close at today? You greasy fuck. Yeah, it's got <laughs> abbreviated a strip club. Yeah, it's, it's <laughs> not, that's gross. It's not shit. cryptocurrency. You fucking weirdo. <laughs> You're banging a stranger who's hurt on the inside. <laughs> well, after the recent events of the graduation of the class of twenty three, Abco's up four fucking points. <laughs> Dumbass. All right, so you went to Abco and you paid this bitch forty bucks. Yeah, she took you to a back room. Yeah, little side guy. Yeah. How long? How many songs in before she was like, "Look, three hundred one." When did you? It was after the first song. Did you diversify her portfolio? Question: If she was not at a strip club, would you have tried to spit game? Absolutely. Okay. She was like, "That's fine. Keep going." Yeah. She was. Yeah. <laughs> you said in your she eyes was so she was a hot, pretty hot. lady in the love of my life. Yeah. I'm sorry, uh, you mean the love bitch. of my life? Dude. Yeah, I would have pursued her outside. All of right, the here, here's here's a very true thing. You telling me so, that this immigrant woman that didn't speak English was going to be the love of my life? Of course, you could bring her home to your mom. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, I'm like, how much did the lap dance cost you? Like in pesos or American? You're like, God <laughs> damn. The exchange rate fucked me on that day. Oh yeah, you're just showing up with funny money at this point. <laughs> <laughs> No. Why, uh, you, why is your 10 shiny? Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> no, I uh, no, I was wondering. So if during your coitus, your consensual coitus. Was it at the club, by the way? Yeah. You're consen- in the room? In the yeah, in like the back back room. Okay, before you ask your question. Oh, my God. Before you ask your question. Dude, you've been fucking tequila stepdadding this entire shut, thing. Shut up. I, all right, go ask ahead. Tequila ask tequila stepdad. Ask your question. No, I was saying if <laughs> mid-consensual, uh, mid-consensual coitus with your professional sex worker uh you if she whispered in your ear let's just get away from here just you and me right now like let's just I, i'll be out back in 10 minutes two business class let's, leads to boise idaho let's just let's just go let's get away well i wanted Would you to leave pull around the car yeah i wanted to leave no but with her what did no, you think like, just like, well like obviously i didn't want to do it in the club i'm like i'm the whole time i was just looking over her shoulder not to get Jumped by a bouncer. So it was a literal GTA situation. Yeah, exactly. You've been to the strip club in GTA before, right? Yeah. yeah. Where the yeah, yeah, where the girls dancing on you and you can the bouncer walks back and forth and you can. It was literally that kind of situation where I was like, you oh, see so your is... pants on, not even pulled all the way down, just like ankles. Yeah. Yeah. Little, Ew. little enchilada poking out through your sitting on the ankles. Couch. Ankles. You are high as shit if your shoe was on your ankles. Yeah. Well, it was like a quick. I could just. No, you put your Peter through the fucking zipper. Call it a day. First off, there's so many other. If you thread your dick through that like fucking razor tooth that zipper, that core yeah. mouth, yeah, of a zipper, yeah. What the it's fuck are you shred thinking? Your pubes. Yeah, not even that. Like sh- pubes flesh, to base, pubes to base. It's gonna be shredded. fucking just like. You think they're gonna be gentle with you? Well, no, you unbutton your pants. Like you unbutton them all the way, but you just keep them. None of y'all ever fuck with jeans on. No, nah, bro. I'm too fat to wear jeans with zippers. Will internal affairs. I've done it. Will yeah, internal I only affairs. wear joggers. I only wear joggers. Uh, I do. I do like wearing loose fitting pants because I need to contain the beast somehow. <laughs> <laughs> That's so stupid, dude. So did you? Did you? Did you bust? Yeah. In the club. Yeah. Busted, so in, busted the in the club and a bottle full of bub. <laughs> I, wa- I want to make bust in this club. <laughs> <laughs> did you? Andrew's coming in the club and bottles are full of bub. <laughs> and then what? <laughs> 
And then you boxed up your food and got out of there? <laughs> 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 I imagine just chicken wing in one hand. And then just like, <laughs> Got him. <'em. laughs> yeah. Dude. I, I was waiting for the moment for that one. Wow. That was perfect. God damn. The only one to go into a strip club and ask for an entree. <laughs> yeah. Can I get a menu? <laughs> you're like, you're weird, my appetizer. You're question. my entree. Uh, did you have a tram stamp? Does that turn you on? Weird question. No, no, because I wanted to bring this up. I wanted to bring this He's up. He's like, what days does she work? Because I sent this. Weird sent question. What color on the toes? Just ask. <laughs> I've been hearing. Uh, I've been hearing some guys that are saying that tram stamps are hot, and I'm nah. and I'm fully against that. I think tram stamps turn anyone into like a one. Uh, tram stamps, yes. Temporary tram stamps, hot as fuck. No, you know what if the new tram stamp to- is? The shoulder tattoo. That's hot as shit. No, the new tram stamp is this shit right here, the side. The the Side what do you call it? The IT band. The well, IT band tattoo, that's the new Cardi B, Nicki like Minaj. Going up to the, their ass and yeah, shit. All yeah, all the way from your ass down to like depending on how hoey you are. That's that's the level. You know how like how long your mullet is determines how how trash you are? Where if your if your thigh tattoo touches your knee bone, you have four black baby daddies. One thousand <laughs> one thousand percent. But, I was wondering. So say you had a gun to like respect a family member's head. And they're just like, we're gonna blow your brain. We're gonna blow their brains out. Unless you have to get a tramp stamp. You can design it, but you have to get a tramp stamp. What would your tramp stamp say? I'd get a DBG in the in the triple X logo, like the Vin Diesel triple X little font. Like oh, the- I thought you meant like deep. For some reason, I just thought of what what was the name of that movie where it's like uh, the guy has the chick has the machine gun for the leg. Oh, um, it's the Danny Trejo one, right? I think not machete. Mm-hmm. Just look it up. Is, ma- I think it is. Look up machine gun leg. <laughs> machete lady. two. Machine with, uh, gun Salma leg. High. Yeah. Machine lady. gun leg lady. Oh, Planet Terror. She has a machine gun for a leg. Yeah. Come on, bro. She's just putting the barrel in the ground. Come That's not good on. for the gun. That's jammed. It's jammed. It's nothing fun. shooting out of that. Uh, besides not. pure vengeance. Also, how do you fire that gun? You have to do a high kick anytime yes. you want to shoot anybody. Yes, and that's how she does it. Is that Michelle Rodriguez? I have no idea. I'm so that... mad. I'm so mad about that. Something about that pisses me off. If, There's mean, a grenade launcher on the bottom. There's a noob tube. Do you see that? Yeah, I know. On the bottom? I know. I imagine that's that you have that as you on your tramp stamp doing the splits, but one gun is a machine gun. One right. You don't have any tattoos, do you? No, I don't. I want to go. Uh, you I told me be... one time you wanted a tattoo on your face. I'm going to slap the fuck out of you. I, I kind of still do, but I want to. Stop. Uh, Look. Uh, Point your cry for help towards something else, not a fucking tattoo. I want to get face. my face slightly lower on my face. Just Steve-O? <laughs> yeah. I want to yeah. get my face on my face. It would be real ironic. I know. It would be fun. I mean, I want to be buried in a Jewish cemetery, so how are you doing with that? Yeah. Uh, I could never get oh, buried. Wow. You fucking, what was Ooh, that? Uh, no, I, yeah. would, I could never get buried in a Jewish cemetery. Yeah, I know. I have a joke about it. You're half black, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I know. It's very funny. What, well, while we're, what was the point of that? You led me down one of my own bits, and I was like, yeah, you probably shouldn't say that. It's pretty dumb. Like, I, I don't know. Oh, you asked me, and I asked you. All right. What's your favorite bar food, dickhead? All right, dude. We're back, and uh, we thought a fun way to, to kind of get the uh, the middle part of this episode going. We're going to take a, uh, a quiz to see if you're an alpha or not. Yeah. Alpha, it says, are you... First off, this is on Quizany. Because so, I feel like the the kind of the essence the of den this pod- of the alpha males, right. Quizany. This is exactly where we need to be at. Because yeah. I feel like the essence of this podcast is me giving you shit for being weak and frail, and you giving me shit for trying to be alpha male. So this is the perfect fucking. No, I have far more things to give you shit. It's fine, but we'll continue. <laughs> Not the fact that you think you're some silverback gorilla or <laughs> yeah. something like that. No, no, no. We'll continue though. But uh, this. So al- we got two separate tests up. We got one for me, one for Tristan. And we're going to walk through these tests and see who's an alpha male, who's a beta, and who's an omega. I can see you being an omega as well. Alpha beta. What is omega? It's a one of one. You're an alpha lone male. Of, yeah, you're an alpha male of your own pack. I may just, dude, I may just be a fucking lone sniper in the hills, dude. <laughs> Find me in my log cabin. <laughs> <laughs> Find just me in my log sniping. cabin. Yeah. <laughs> just, it's in there. Ah, that's I'm pretty like, good. You're fat. And then you're <laughs> the fat. All right, sauce. So let's, yeah. so let's take it. Let's do the first question. Let's see what we right. So... Let Andrew be the announcer. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like that. All right. So the first question is: Someone bumps into you. What do you do? We have their fucking well, and face then he off. Has to, and then he has to he has to read the uh, ask the honestly. So it's let the crowd hype you up, walk away briskly, or excuse yourself and walk off. 
on your own. Okay. And answer the answer these honestly, honestly, because I do want to see the answers at the end and see where we're at. So you go first. I mean, I guess I don't. To be fair, it's I don't know if my answer would quite qualify. I think but it depends I, on where it's at, right? Kill yourself. Yes, I would immediately pull out a gun and blow my brains out and say, "You did this." Just grunts on Halo <laughs> on like a low level, and just yeah. run away. And be like, ah! Just pull out two grenades, like ah, and just fucking blow myself up in the corner of the room. Uh, no, I'd say if someone actually, like, if I'm walking through somewhere and someone bumps into me, I'm definitely going to be like, yo, what the fuck? Like now on a level of like, yo, what the fuck? Will you stop your motion and turn around or you just give like a, the fuck was that? No, like I'll turn like a stop. Like what the fuck? I mean, it's disrespectful. I'm just, I'm not judging. I'm just asking your answer. I just want to make sure. All right. So, so I would that. like so if that's the so if that's my, the case, my answer is to is to walk away briskly. I'm not I'm not turning around and like if someone really bumps into me, I'm just, what the hell? You just keep walking. I'm I, not, so does mine fall away? Fall into let the crowd hype me up? Yeah, that yeah. Would, that would yours be. is let the crowd hype you up. All right. Your favorite Rugrat, what Chucky, does this have Tommy, to do Angelica, <laughs> Daniel knows Tommy. Uh, which Tommy one? Easy? I guess. I don't know. You're Angelica, one thousand percent. I was yeah, gonna say he's Angelica. Chucky. I'm probably gonna say he's Chucky. Oh with god, the, the allergies in Austin right, are so work, bad. Do you work out at home <laughs> with fr- with my friends whenever I want to, dude? Whenever I fucking want. Yeah, that's a fact. Easily, Tristan. <laughs> I'm always, is none of the above. In the I'm always working. Out. I'm gonna put him as whenever I want to. Yeah, whenever I want to. <laughs> sure. I just haven't wanted that's to. That's true. Yet. Yeah. Dance lessons with a partner. I can't dance. Sign me up, Daniel. I already know your answer. I can't dance. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. You want me to do that whole knee moving shit? Yeah. yeah. Can you do that whole bit for me real quick? <laughs> I'd say with a partner. With a partner. Yeah. Right. I'm not gonna go solo right. to a dance class. Dining alone. I prefer. It. Does it matter to me? Absolutely not. I know, I know what I would do. Doesn't matter to me. Like I could go out on a date with my girl. I love that also. But like, I've definitely been known to like step into like a, a sit down restaurant and just eat by yourself. I like do that. Fucking that's I do I, half the shit I do. I do by myself. Bro, to me, more sitting enjoyable. sitting in a place and getting really good food and propping my phone up and watching like YouTube videos <laughs> while I eat shit. <laughs> I just imagine, what the fuck, I imagine, bro? I imagine bro, going, never, into, like, in and, going into like an in and out and sitting in the corner. And that's just, not like, a restaurant. That's not that's a, a restaurant. That's <laughs> a, that's <laughs> a sit down. You could sit down. That's a fast go to food all, sit down. I would go to an Olive Garden by myself. Okay, okay people go to Starbucks with their laptops. Let's all Sorry. just shut the fuck up. Everyone is talking over each yeah. other. You're not wrong. It's, you go. it's mental chaos. First off, I imagine that Andrew brings a framed photo of his abuela and sits down and says, this is our favorite restaurant, and asks for her entree to go so he can eat it in the car. And I would not do it, mostly because if I sit and eat alone somewhere, no matter what I'm doing, it looks like I'm plotting. So I can't <laughs> I can't do that. All right, so absolutely not. Absolutely not. Uh, movies on, a, movies on a first date. Yeah. Movies on a first date? Yeah, did, let's go. I've done that, yeah, for sure. All right, let's go. Easy. You gotta go to, yeah, let's go. Yeah. All right. Uh, do you like to share? Depends with whom. No, sure. Yeah. Depends with whom. I usually like to share. Easy. Sure. No, I share most shit. Uh, what do you do at parties? Whatever I want to tell great stories. Sit off in a into a corner. Sit off in a corner for sure. Now, but you gotta understand though, it's not a weird. I'm a loner. Sit off in a corner. Like the way that athletes did parties is is like we're sort of the attraction. I right? don't think they have nuance. It's three questions. I'm just kind of explain. We're doing a long form podcast, ass crack. We're it's not like, trying to speed through these questions. Yeah. Well, like there's 29, so let's kind of. We'll yeah, no, yeah. The way that the way that we would do parties is like you stood in a corner, and it's like the girls and everyone. Yeah, you're trying knew. to find a door frame to flex in, and then fucking, yeah. So the way I do parties, I'm gonna sit, sit in the corner, wait for you to come to me. I'm tell great stories. It's like with the homies, though. So it's like right. not weird. Well, yeah, all the other football yeah. players. Yeah. yeah. Would uh, you ever be in a fashion show? Of course not for me. Depends now on I've if been I have in a the fashion time. show. We did a fashion show. Check out the reel on the for the t shirt. That'll be out. I've done yeah. a fashion show and this is trash. I've gone to like one of my mom's friends who was like a manager at Macy's and they need to do like uh showing their next line of like, you know, shit coming out, but not like uh not like real fashion shows where it's like concepts of the shit coming out, like they have you wear their polos and khakis and shit, and then you get 50% off anything that you wore. So That's really, my mom put me in it as a way to, like, back imagine, to school shop. Imagine your mom's, like, she's with, like, another housewife. She's like, which one's yours? Like, for two months, none of them. <laughs> yeah, absolutely yeah. not one. <laughs> yeah. 
Try Wait, it. you mean the one not keeping his fucking head straight? That's not mine. That's what not, the hell is that? Is that a go full hips? pageant mom on you? <laughs> Just like puts a book on athlete, your head? Athlete mom and pageant mom have yeah, a lot of similarities. Yeah, those cross over. Yeah. All right, go to the next question. I would say I, we, we haven't answered. Have answered. I literally just said I've done a fashion show. Okay, Would so you, of course. Uh, okay. Yeah. I would say it depends on if I have the time. All right. That's would a, you, your hero, Donald Trump, Paul Ryan, Barack Obama. These are, you go first. Barack. I know you yours. I know <laughs> yours. I know yours. <laughs> Flash the image. 2024. <laughs> oh, God. Barry already did his shit, bro. I'll go Barry. Barry? Oh, I'm going Barry. <laughs> I'm going Barry. You, you make Daniel. What about you, Uncle I Ruckus? Can't, I can't. Be- <laughs> what about you, Uncle Ruckus? The amount of times I've been called <laughs> Uncle Ruckus. Shut your ass up. Yeah. Uncle you Tom. can't. You Shut can't. your ass up, boy. <laughs> Shut your ass up, bitch. Well, I tell you what. You can't. These good can't, white people. I can't be a, a Donald Trump loving conservative Republican and you call Barack Obama Barry. But also, look how it's spelled. <laughs> Donaldo Trump. <laughs> Donald, Donald. All right, yeah. All right, most m- your hero out of the who? First of all, go back. Who's Paul Ryan? Who is I have that? no clue. Who we can that? Google Paul Ryan. I think he's a. I think he's the speaker. He was the, the speaker of the house a few years Honestly, ago. I'm actually like, just out of high school, so I know this. Really? I do. They all don't right. teach speaker. Of and the is house. he a is he a middle guy? Is that why they put him? No, up he's there? conservative. I watch oh. CNN 10 with Carla Zeus. Party Republican. You're a CNN. You're a. That's just what they played at school. Oh, okay. I, I thought you were talking about now. I was like, wait, are you a Fox? Man? I haven't are watched you? news in years. Are you, like, are you a political pundit? Like, yeah, no, mine would, mine would definitely be. be Donald J. 1,000%. For those of you wondering, you know. All right. Uh, would you change your looks? I could always use some work. I don't know. I'm fine just the way I am. I'm fine just the way I Ugh. am. But yours is a fun, ironic answer. Mine is also, I'm fine just the way I am. Sorry, I like me a touch. It's took... 24 years. <laughs> all right, pick a show. This is us, Grey's Anatomy, Atlanta. I've watched all. I know the answer should be Atlanta. For those of you, that, <laughs> for those of you at home, they're like, pick the black show. I've watched all of This Is Us. This Is Us. Okay. Yeah. Tristan, um, I've really never seen those, but just uh, Atlanta. I think that's the one I've seen the most of. Wow, you're making. Daniel looks horrible in this. I'm actually kind of sweating. I am, like, hot. am I going to lose? Damn, I have hot You're not sauce. an alpha, omega, or a beta. You're just not black anymore, Daniel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what it says at the end. Yeah. It's like not nah. I got hot sauce in my purse. <laughs> <laughs> this Hillary Clinton. Are, Are you, afraid you afraid of heights? Of heights? I'll go if you go. Um, Yeah, it depends on my surroundings. I'm not afraid of heights at all. Depends uh, on my surroundings. That shit is scary as fuck. All right, so what would be your answer, Daniel? Cause there's I'll a... go if you go, I guess. Okay. Yeah. All right, favorite food, tacos, chicken nuggets, vegan pulled pork sandwiches. Chicken, out of those, chicken nuggets. Okay. Probably tacos. You don't like tacos? You mean yeah. boneless wings? Yeah, well, I, was gonna, I like chicken. Chicken's my favorite meat. It's poultry. Pause. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes racism is just a fish. Oh, here's a fun question. <laughs> <laughs> Do, you cr- <laughs> Do you cry in public if I experience something sad? I'd rather keep that private. Yes. Rather keep that private. No. You, 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 what a f- Me? It's a public episode. What a internal affairs. <laughs> Tristan rather, attempts to lie on this I'd rather set. That. No, I'm very no, I'm very so Tristan, conscious one of my early shit. on one of my early interactions with you was you crying in public. So what was like, I crying in public? Outside of JP's when your world was ending. Was, oh yeah, no, that wasn't JP's on stand up live. Yeah. What happened? Internal affairs. Internal uh, affairs. Uh, internal affairs. But yeah, I'd something that might have lost you the contest, it, right? Yeah. There. So they, <laughs> I'd rather keep private, but uh, unfortunately, yes. it, I'd rather keep it that private. But for ten dollars a month, we'll spill the beans. Yeah. Now, is the real answer yes, or is the real answer right? no? The real answer is the real answer. I'd rather keep that private. <laughs> Mark that man for yes. I'm, no, because. No, me Have saying. You, say, tell me, no, you've never cried in public. That's. Do you know? Have you ever cried in public? I have. Okay, put him down for. You. So you've never cried in public ever? N- not one time. I do not believe that. Oh, he's lying. Not when sure. you were getting kicked I've out. Seen him. You I've were in public at that point. When? 
Dude, you would get in trouble with your mom and your parents all the time when we were out. Crying in front of your bubble. That's public. Target, Walmart, fucking Echo, hey, bro, Unlimited. Cut like. this man's mic. Shut the <laughs> what? Oh, okay. <laughs> fucking came on right. my own shit. <laughs> I'm crying looking at a Bugs Bunny double XL t shirt and yeah, smoking a cigarette. You just want and ones and you're fucking <laughs> weeping. Mom, Dude. those navy on Carolina blue and ones are so sick. But like, like Macy's isn't modeling those. Get in line. <laughs> All right, so I've cried in public. Okay. Yeah, yes. for sure. That's a yes on both. Uh, ideal vacation, partying in Dubai, a quiet bungalow in Florida, or backpacking in South America? A quiet bungalow in South Florida because I can fish. Yes, sir. Yeah. Tristan? Probably Florida. I love Florida. I was, I'm from Florida. All right. You got Florida energy. Someone sure. wants to fight you. How do you handle it? My friends have my back. I don't like to fight. I'm down for whatever. Knee pads <laughs> in the car, baby. My friends, <laughs> have, my friends <laughs> have my back. I'm rolling up loud and I'm rolling up heavy. I was going to say, just to let you know, the person that would be fighting Tristan is going to be a lot less scary than the guy that's going to agree to fight me at a place. So the answer, my friends have my back, would be a sick answer to have. But you guys are fighting the mountain from Game of Thrones. So, <laughs> that's fine. So that's, that's fine. Or some drunk so, guy at, so some I, drunk guy at a I show. Think, I think the answer is I don't like most the fight. Most of the time, most you definitely th- don't. Because anyone just, just if I don't open my mouth and you can hear the innocence and kind of Caucasianness in my voice, if you just see dreadlocks and, and toneness and chocolate skin, the guy that's like just off of seeing that is like, yeah, I'm still about to run this man's cheek. Good luck with that. Yeah. Pause. Are you about good, to good say cheeks Pause. Though? Why are you? Why is any man running your cheeks? It's like a New York, like you know, if a New Yorker tells you to. Oh, suck you know my how you like? It's not a gay you, thing. You know it's how like you're like a, from New York, right? Yeah. No, from Phoenix, we say run them cheeks. No, no. Bro, Nobody like if I'm about to, no. bro, if I'm about no. to glass your maybe ass maybe at up, Charlie's they say that. <laughs> <laughs> Look, if I'm if I'm really about to like mold your ass, like glass your shit up. That's <laughs> <laughs> where where did what hood did you grow if up? I'm about off to, Melrose. If I'm what the fuck? Hey, yo, what colors you repping right now? Rainbow pride. All of them. So yeah. I guess, yeah. So I guess the answer is I don't like the friends. All right. How yeah. many friends do you have? About two good friends. I have a close. Everyone knit. you see on cast right now. I That's wouldn't agree it. with that. <laughs> <laughs> a close knit group of about five or less. I can't count them all. I know Tristan's answer. Mine's I, I have a close knit group of five close knit for you as well, Tristan. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I'd say close knit. Yeah. Close knit group about five or less. <laughs> you imagine if he was like, I got about two good friends. You're like, fuck, fam. <laughs> you're like, I don't I'm hate it. I'm going to have to battle Hayden and Haley. Yeah, yeah. you're like, Jesus. <laughs> Just Thunderdome, dude. No. All right, pick an instrument guitar, violin, drums. Mm. That's a good um, one. Shit. Well, I mean, I know how to play guitar. So. I don't know, but what's your favorite one to like listen to? Like, if you hear it in a song, that's like that's the one that. Well, picks if up. I could pick like to be, say, if I was like the best at any of these, drums for sure, drums. Okay, right, Daniel, drums also. Okay. Best entertainer of all time: Michael Jackson, Amy Winehouse, Prince. Mm. Come, He's on. Innocent. Come on, He's innocent. He <laughs> innocent. MJ, MJ. Yeah, it's mine too. I was gonna say Prince here for a sec, but then yeah, he's he's good too. Yeah, but no, no one beats yeah. MJ, bro. He would stand there for thirty seconds silent. Ooh, okay, pick yeah, a sure. color: purple, blue, or red. Purple till I die. Probably out of those, red. Yeah. Yes, sir. Oh, I saw this next question. <laughs> pick a news outlet. <laughs> I love how this factors into if you're an alpha Fox mailer. News, MSNBC, <laughs> CNN. Daniel, I don't even need to ask. Go first, Tristan. I'd say probably MSNBC. Cuck. <laughs> like a cuck. <laughs> I don't watch the news. I so is that, I, I feel like CNN is definitely. No, but I'll pick the fucking uh, grown up answer. Fox News, please. Infowars. <laughs> Infowars. <laughs> That's the Bro, real alpha male answer. The bitch, the bitch for Fox News is bad as hell. Lori Ingram or whatever her name is. You know exactly what her name is. <laughs> yeah, Lori Ingram. <laughs> yeah, you literally said her full fucking name. Yeah. Lori yeah. Ingram or however long two years she's been reporting there. At Lori Ingram Fox News exclamation point or whatever her name is. Like. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I don't even watch. All What's the time. your senior superlative? Most popular, most academia, most likely to succeed. Um, I'd say most likely to succeed. Most likely to die with a needle in his arm. <laughs> oh my <laughs> internal affairs. What the? I'm fuck? turning it around. <laughs> most likely to succeed. Okay, Daniel. Most likely to code switch. That's not on here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> most likely to tear an ACL and say that that's why you didn't make it in the NFL. <laughs> Most likely to most likely to blame failed football career on ligaments. Uh, <laughs> most likely to have a local show and carry themselves like the Booker. Uh, 
<laughs> you really would think I'm the book. Yeah, the yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Then the, <laughs> the answer is most popular. <laughs> I was a quarterback. We don't have an answer. I wasn't the most what popular, sports, but that was my you, parents' What sport doing. would you play? Uh, I'd probably say hockey. Okay. I do really enjoy hockey. <laughs> I wanted to play hockey when I was younger. Why are you just, doing the moment? Why, I'm not tennis. Dude, I could see you playing female tennis. You'd be a <laughs> solid female. Not even regular. If I transitioned. Tennis. Not even doubles. If I transitioned. Straight female. If I transitioned. Nah, just put your frame right now. Yeah. You'd be a sick female tennis player. Yeah. Mine's football, obviously. Yeah, me and Serenia, Serena Williams, Serenia, 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 Serenia Johnson, bro. Yeah. Who is that? Did you pick hockey because figure skating wasn't on there? <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> no, I don't. That's just the closest it, thing. Sorry, no. Is crying to Joji on there? You fucking dumbass. <laughs> but it's provocative. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Anyways, what I, uh, I'm gonna go restart the cameras. Yeah. <laughs> Come at me, boy. Hey, that was inside the park home run in my book, fam. <laughs> you hear a thump outside your bedroom. What do you do? Um, call the authorities, hide under the covers. Sue, go who out. got the goddamn ball? We, to be we have on the my answer phone? to this exact question for Tristan. Yeah. Go out with a baseball bat and investigate. I had a frying uh, pan and I went out to save my neighborhood. Rock, paper, scissors, my check to see who goes and investigates. <laughs> so Not I'm gonna even put, I'm gonna a put fucking hide. second. I <laughs> left up, grabbed a frying pan and a knife, and I got up. I was a fucking knight in that moment. You came out in like one of those weird long john onesie outfits with like a double barrel. Just be like, who No, I, I came out I came out in my leopard pleasures pants and a tank top with a fucking frying pan and a knife. God, dude, some weirdo from Pride Months trying to shoot me with a <laughs> or you came out. <laughs> Shoot me! Knife, shoot I you guess. with a knife? Yeah, yeah. I He's got a, a I got a crossbow, motherfucker. Uh, I guess my my honest answer is honestly not. Probably the, call the authorities. Yeah, I'm not the first guy to like. If I heard some shit going on, like actually, just just to be real, we don't live in like the greatest complex. Right? There's a couple of people. Downstairs. I think we know exactly how I feel about this. Oh, personal space. Um, I I was about to say, don't touch my shoulders. Yeah, don't touch my shoulders. Uh, I value it. I like my space, but I can share it as well. I love I love being the center of attention. That's not what the it third says one I love says. Being That's in the absolutely center. not what the third one says. I I I, I can't read very well, and I kind of ran with yeah. what I thought. The third yeah. one says I love being in the center, which is not the I same. I love being in the center of attention, and no. also sometimes personal I enjoy- sp- personal space is not the same as center of attention. Because when I'm on stage, I'm the center of attention, but my personal space is pushed back. That's different. You can like people being upon you. I like my space, but. Uh, then I can share it as well. If you've okay. gained my trust, I'm like a petting zoo animal. I value I value my personal. Space. You have to give don't, me oats. No, don't come. Don't come with my shit. What's the best fad? F- fast, fast. Jesus, fucking Christ! Fuck. Fuck. Almighty, Checker. twenty-seven checkers. questions. Checkers. And the wheels are falling off. Checkers, 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 checkers. Have you ever been to Checkers? I have no idea. It's what a South thing. Is. When I took a visit to Duke, we went to Checkers. No, I'm doing. I'm doing Checkers. I'm doing Checkers too. I used to go there all the time in Florida. Checkers rules. Are you in love all the time? I'm saving it for someone special. Not yet, but I'll know when it happens. All the time, Over baby. under, he says Haley six times. All the time, I'm in love with God. I'm in love with Christ. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in love with my gospel, my church, Christianity. Uh, <laughs> I'm a Tristan, dude. Uh, <laughs> That's gonna be your go mites. Yeah, shout out yeah. to all the Tristians. Shout out Tristians. Uh, read your Bible. Uh, His vapes, the Holy Spirit. Yeah, dude. This His is a, Bible is just a caution warning on the box of the vapes he buys. No, my Bible. You open it up and it's just a rolling tray on the inside with a Jesus photo of Christ. Haley. Are you in love all the time? I love God. I love Christ. I love my friends. Mm-hmm. I love my friends. You love people that respond on Tinder. We get it. All right. Me? Oh yeah, nice. the one. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say I love the only person who responds on Tinder. It's great. <laughs> Daniel. Yeah, probably, probably all the time. Okay. No. No. It's I all mean, the time. I mean, yeah. You love one person all the time. Yeah. So yeah. I'm saving it for someone special. Yeah. All the time. Yeah, my second one. No. Yeah. <laughs> my cut, s- his mic. <laughs> cut his mic. Cut his mic. Who ha- who passed the mascot to this guy? <laughs> yeah. Who gave? I don't know. You try to get fucking Aldo to pour you two fingers, and then you're like, Daddy needs to do it Honestly, himself. Honestly, when I said two fingers, did you know what that meant or no? I was just going to pour 
whatever so, came out. So two fingers, two fingers it. it's it's this right from the bottom of the from the bottom of the shit. Not that hard. You know what's funny is I I serve alcohol you don't, as a as a job and I but you don't, you don't, <laughs> you don't make it. That's different. You just balance the shit and bring it to people. Dude, it's, it's different if you have to make the shit, it, right? Well, yeah, but like sometimes people have questions and I don't know I don't know the answers. Yeah, like they're I'm like eighteen, bro. They're what like, what are your tequila? Can you list me your tequila? I'm like, bro, I can't list you three tequilas right now. Well, that's now. a that's a different. Like, like, I'm not even allowed to look at the tequila. We were all we were all. Tell me if I'm wrong. We were all the same way. Like before you turn 21, you, your knowledge of it's a big deal when you can. And I'm still trying to figure it out. I'm not that much older than you. When you walk into a bar and you know your drink, that's a big deal. When you when you're younger than 21, that's the easiest way people can tell you're not 21. Is you walk in, you're like, let me get a. Well, I started mm. I started going to bars at 17, so I knew my drink pretty quickly. Same yeah, is just from doing stand AMF. up and stuff. I just fucking. I you did. almost had to fuck yourself getting in there, though. You had to get what, like an X on your hand, or kind of knew that, like, yeah, your dad yeah. Was after with you. a, after a while, I mean, like, if I just went to when I went to High Side and stuff like that, which is like now fucking deep in the grave, uh, like, uh, I just fucking I would walk in, I'd just be like, can I get a vodka? Can I get a vodka ginger ale? And they'd be like, yeah, sure. And then, Two limes. No, no limes in the vodka ginger. But in a mm. new place though, like if a new mic opened, you would have to walk up with your dad and be like, "I'm clearly yeah, not yeah, 21. no, yeah, 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 yeah. I would have to do that, yeah. But like, because uh, that knew. is one of the perks to getting further along in comedy is you get free free alcohol. Yeah, or reduced it sucks. price. Yeah, reduced I had price to. Alcohol. I had to stop. Like I got too much. Yeah, I was well, doing it too much. Yeah, well, yeah, but that's a it's. That's that's honestly why there's probably so many sober comics. I was bringing your club ac- drinking home. Yeah, well, your access to just like alcohol is not generally cheap. I know when you can, or unless you want to get like steel reserve and plastic vodka. But if you're that's work, a, that's a game move, dude. Someone left it. That's how I know I don't live in a in a nice place. There was a steel reserve bo- empty bottle at the bottom of my stairs this morning, and I was like, "We have to." Move. Dude, when we I started, when I started, yeah, we have to get out. When I started drinking, I didn't know alcohol like hard alcohol came in glass bottles. I only drank plastic. That's bottles. That's not good. And so, there's a there's a perfect. Although you should be in your peak plastic bottle years right now. Uh, I don't drink at all, but when we did, we just steal Coors Light. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, but, good too. but well, when, before you're 21, any alcohol you can get your hands on is the correct alcohol. There's no. Yeah. And while we're talking about this, the last question, question 29 out of 29, Andrew. Oh, sure. Where you? How do you handle peer pressure? I can overcome anything. <laughs> it's a bit overwhelming. <laughs> I don't acknowledge it. It's a bit overwhelming for this guy. How do you handle peer pressure? It's a bit overwhelming, but I can overcome it. I All just right, say no, 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 and then I leave. I'm going to I'm gonna turn off the display so I could reveal the results. Okay. And obviously, I deal with peer pressure. Peer pressure. Like. Peer pressure. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm fucked cutting fucked you off, Daniel. I'm five sorry. No minutes. one's drunk. I'm not, I can't serve someone who's intoxicated. No, shut your ass. You're cut off. I'm like five fucking Uber. minutes ago. This internal affair is going to be fun. I'm uh, calling an Uber. Yeah, obviously my answer is whatever the closest to like I don't really succumb to peer, to peer pressure like that. Yeah. That's a dickhead thing to say, but for the most part. I fold so fast. Well, you can't. That's just contradicting like my personality. You can't walk in and I be literally like, left a quarter of the Ritalin on the counter i'm just like if you want it and you're just like oh. <laughs> i'm just like did you even want it you're like i don't know <laughs> he said maybe i actually no you okay well that's just with ritalin because i like ritalin well ritalin's great ritalin's great i got yes. dosed with, with ritalin my sophomore that's not, year what? that's not dosing should we Dose do tristan first you momentarily didn't have adhd no let's right, do here we go. let's do daniel first do Trist- do wow. Daniel first does that mean i'm mirror. a beta no no, 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 no. It, it stopped comedically do who stop mirroring yeah so, Comedically, do you know whoever you know you feel fit, but yeah, pull it up. Let's see what the uh, let's see what the results are. Interesting. All right, we're pulling up. What do you Daniel, think? Daniel what do you think? Sirs? You think you're alpha or a beta? But you know what? I think or I'm, an omega. I think I'm just a good ass guy. Think you're man. a beta or a beta? Go ahead. A beta or a beta? <laughs> Go ahead. I'm beta O'Rourke. <laughs> I'm Beto, and I yeah. support this message. I'm beta O'Rourke, and I support this message. All right, drum roll, please. Uh, I don't. I, I don't have a. For Tristan, bowling, are you an alpha, beta, or omega? The results are... I'm HIV positive. An uh, ad. <laughs> Watch it be like, you got to pay $30 to alpha. see your results. I'm an alpha. An alpha guy. Ooh. Nice. Head of the pack. Alpha Hal right there. Look, Look at, at you. People flock to you because of your charisma, charm, and you can't help but eat it up. I can't Their praises help. fuel your fire, Fucking and it burns bright. Burn you, me take up, life. you take a life. I take a life. Every time I you, need to get stronger, I take a life. 
you take life by the hand and seize the day to everyone around you. You Carpe are an diem, unstoppable. Dog. I'm unstoppable, dude. You are an unstoppable force. I who am. Can't be denied. Try and deny Hello, me. Hello, extrovert. <laughs> yeah, try and deny me. I'll All dunk 130 on pounds you. of it. 130 pounds of pure undeniability. <laughs> He's like, bro, I'm like three percent Nick Salt naturally. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm dude. If someone hit me, if someone, if I evaporated and you breathed me in, it'd be like six percent. Jesus Christ! All right, pull up my. If it's anything other than Alpha, I know this is. And for Daniels. Drum roll. For Daniels. Dram- Drum roll, please. Dram- We're going to make this one special. Alpha. Thank nice you. Oh, what? Yes, sir. Yeah. Uh, Look right. at you. Too People flock same. to you because you uh, because what? of your charisma and charm. No, and look. you can't oh, help but eat it's, it's it up. We got a quiz shit. for next week. <laughs> Is your friendship toxic? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Ask my girlfriend. Yes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What? Yeah. Is your is your friendship toxic? I don't know. Do they save corner that. you Please in a room? Please fucking save that because we need to take that quiz. Bookmark it. Look, all I'm saying, it's good that you're an alpha. I never disagreed that you were an alpha. I call you a beta bitch pretty You often. literally absolutely call you nothing but disagree that I'm an alpha 100% Look, of the time. I call you a beta bitch pretty often, but I wouldn't surround myself with people that are Do you think Quizoni would lie to Do us? Do you think Quizoni would lie? All those shirtless chads who run <laughs> Quizoni, Quizoni, all those perfect square jaws behind those keyboards clicking. Yeah, clacking. Mar- Do you think the marketing department from Muscle Milk would lie? No. You know Shamrock what? Muscle Milk, just like the basic ass one, <laughs> just real shit, just bros protein. Yeah, yeah. No, but yeah, I'm not. Gonna, I'm not gonna surround myself with betas. I make me a beta inherently. I surround myself with. No, you are a beta, and you surround yourself with alphas. So we're your bodyguards. Facts. Look at us. We protect you from the real world. That's how we think. I that's mean, what, I, that's what we're thinking. I know who I am. I don't know about that, but I know who I am. So Brody you're in a, take you're in a o- you're in an opaque quiz. tight T right now, and okay. you're gonna come at me. Tell me why my Fucking girl traps, likes it. Traps are exploding out of that T. Traps are exploding. Is that the right color? Wait, wait. Can you show me uh, what color opaque is? How do you opaque. Spell I that? think it's a O P A Q U E. I think I was wrong. I was looking for the. Uh, I think the, uh, or G U E. What's the uh, Native American? Opaque. I think opaque stone is like I was a, looking for. It's fuck. like a what's it called? It's called uh, turquoise. You there we go. Turquoise. Yeah. How the yeah, fuck did you, you get stupid, opaque? Bro? Opaque is like a, from turquoise. You're thinking, okay, you're thinking like up. opal. Mezcal menace to shut, the rescue. Bro, shut, uh, okay, I'll give you that. Yeah. It's been the past two Saturdays, Towards, man. You kind of nailed the color. How did you nail opal so well? Jesus Christ! You should Is be that a, right? You should be a, no color. Go opal color. I think did I get you, it right? You should be a jewelry appraiser. Wait, wait, pull it up because I'm, I'm not wrong. Thank yeah, take you. the R out of color. Thank that you. really that helped. Thank it's a little you. Darker, but you guys were talking shit. You close. guys were talking shit. It's pretty opaque. You didn't say that though. I said, said opaque, opaque, asshole. I said it's not the same thing. I'll let you have this one. Thank you. Look at you. You could work at you could work at Sherman. You guys Williams. just like to call me. <laughs> you guys just like to call me CTE, and then I got hit in the fucking head a bunch. And, and I don't now know you what can I'm perfectly about. identify colors. Wow, is this what you get from a D one career? Is that you can somehow? What's next? You can smell sound. You fucking dumbass. Pretty fucking much. Yeah, you're just I, having <laughs> brain. You have a brain tumor that is causing all this stuff. I can tell you the exact sugar to the gram of like standard Powerade. That's a that's a fun skill you learn. I think that's autism. <laughs> no wrong. Time yeah. was where we at? Ten. Ten minutes left. Ten How'd minutes you know? left. We didn't oh. get to this part. I was trying to get. I'm fucking hungry as shit, and I'm definitely gonna. I'm yeah, munching hard. So bad. Uh, Mickey D, Mickey D's, Wells Fargo, and sugar before the uh, do before the I. Yeah. I don't even really want to go to Mickey D's. All yeah, I don't have three hundred dollars. For Mickey D's, <laughs> is that what you spend there at McDonald's? Three hundred bucks. <laughs> you can just get the dollar menu, buddy. Uh, no, he uh, is. favorite bar. Oh. <laughs> dude, all those all three of, for three. All those hitting dingers today, dude. Was that a hard R on that? Dingers, bro. <laughs> Chill yeah, yeah. the fuck out. No, uh, sorry, f- Lauren. Favorite Wait. bar food? Can we end on this? Can we end on the favorite bar food? Favorite bar all, food. We're all comedians or friend of comedians. We're all hungry. And we're all out. We go to bars. We go. All right. If you're out, it's 11:30 p.m. and you want some food, you're at a bar, like a dive bar type place. What's your What's your go to? And it's like 
everything's open. Everything's open. Eleven thirty p.m. All right. Bars um, are closed till one. You're good to go. All right. So this is like dream menu. Definitely some jalapeno poppers. Getting them's. Okay. Getting some peener poppers. Pop it a peener right in my mouth. Yeah, we're good. We got it. I got a peener. Mm-hmm. We in my got tongue. it. Okay. Cream cheese peener <laughs> down the hatch. And then probably mozzi sticks. Fucking bouquet right in the hole. Down the hatch. And um fuck. I usually I may get like a burger. Or yeah. like well, it probably wings and stuff like that too. It's you did that all wrong. So you're gonna go at eleven thirty, you're gonna order you're going to shit your brains out. You're going to have to take a in-pup. I don't think this is... what. It's not a wise meal. You're going to have to take an in-pup... Are you going to get We're ch- talking about favorite bar food. Yeah, are you getting a chopped salad, you fucking queef? No. Why are you, are you getting a five-course meal, though, at a at Yeah, a bar, you ordered like. multiple rounds. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to... I have friends. Having them around the table. So you're getting... So you're getting... Uh, okay. uh, let, me, let me get more Question, specific. Question, what do you dip in the jalapeno poppers in? Jalapeno poppers? Blue cheese. Disgusting. Fuck you. Fucking what do you drink? Nasty. Ranch? I like blue cheese ranch? as well, but I actually prefer ranch for a jalapeno popper. Nah, nah, nah. See, ranch that's for wings, ranch for jalapeno poppers. Dude, that. ranch is fucking you're disgusting. A boneless, you're a boneless wing guy. We talked about this we earlier. We just talked outside how I do both. So how are you going to come on the yeah, podcast Yeah, you're bisexual. He swings yeah. both yeah. ways. Yeah, you're yeah. bisexual. Yeah, it's bisexual right. chicken For wings, guy. yeah. Yeah, and there's chicken no, is chicken. And there's no bisexual niggas, so point it Chicken, fat chicken. You like boneless wings. You got a boneless attitude right now, man. Yeah, 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 if you've ever eaten a boneless wing once, you like boneless wings. Dude, you're you got boneless wing <laughs> attitude with honey mustard dipping sauce. That's, That's where you're at. That's yeah. a bottom right there. <laughs> if you've eaten the boneless, I might try that as a bit. If you've eaten, if you've eaten the boneless wing once, you like boneless wings. <laughs> No, you know, yeah, I funny in that. No, I get All it. Right. I get it. Yeah. 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 yeah, it's hysterical. Sorry, yeah. I really <laughs> hit it out of the park with that one. All Good right. job. Fuck guys. it. We may be dr- we might be drunk as 90% running bits by each other, but I can't run one by you guys. Andrew, I'm sorry. Andrew is holding your jokes up with his laughs. Is what he's doing. <laughs> Just a soft yeah, little wheeze. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You sound like that like broken toy from Toy Story 2. Yeah, the penguin. Yeah, the little penguin. <laughs> little coffee. Man, what would uh, I would say probably peony poppers, fried okra, fried okra. What the, what fuck, the fuck, fuck, fuck are you going to? And this yeah. man will say you're wrong just for getting jalapeno poppers. I know he's just fried like, okra. Uh, yeah. If, if 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 you if you walk into a place, he's the motherfucker that goes to a bar and is like, do you guys have tilapia? Do you on have the tempura menu? shrimp? <laughs> no. Do you have ahi what's tuna? The, what's, what's the catch of the day today? If you walk in... Is there a tank with lobsters? I would like to choose my kill. <laughs> Side note, have you ever picked a lobster from Red Lobster? No, I just... Yeah, I picked one out, and then I have it killed, and then I just don't even eat it. I sit there, and I jerk off to the death well, no, of the being real. Have you ever, like, walked it? And, like, that's, that's a just weird... Just give him a nice cum tribute. Just makes me feel powerful. <laughs> and I come on the lobster, and I take a photo of it and send it to the... Lo- I put it on the lobster tank. I think, and I, I think, say, you're next. I and then I have to the, go to the next town over because I keep getting kicked out. That's, <laughs> that's the ultimate benchmark for whether or not you were raised... Kind of classy or not classy. If you come on a lobster after they bring it out at Red Lobster, then take <laughs> yeah. a photo and print out a no, photo. That's for the, put that's for the, for the butter cheese rolls. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> which are crack. Yeah. Uh, have you ever, if you look at Red Lobster as a fancy restaurant or not? No. To you, is Red Lobster fancy? I've never been to a Red Lobster. I'm not lying. I've never been. Mostly because my dad, when I was younger, he had never been. And he said, like, I, it's been like... 40 years of my life and I've never been to a Red Lobster. If I eat at Red Lobster, it'll cause a series of events that will lead to my death. He knows it. So mental health is pretty strong. No. (laughs) No, he just knows. I can't eat a Red Red Lobster or I die. Yeah, never. And that's normal. You heard that. It was like, well, that's also a bit. Yeah, it's like kind of a bit. It's not like a real true thing. Hey, comedy podcast, cheer up. How am I? Uh, (laughs) What about that? Right. What? So what do you what do you mean? What about that? The actual true fallacy that like my dad wouldn't eat at Red. I don't think he's just ever ate a Red. He doesn't have the desire to, but he just hasn't ever eaten there. So he made up a funny story to tell his child. You know how you entertain a child when you're trying to be a good dad. 
Do you this, know? This explains a lot of my childhood. My yeah, mom's like, he, so we're not going to Disneyland today, and here's why. And I'm like, that excuse makes sense. Yeah, he's just like, we're not going. Acceptable? Because, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Acceptable. We're, go- we're not going because someone only caught us 35% off at Macy's because someone doesn't know how to keep their fucking shoulders square and their back straight. Looking back, that was a pretty bad move. Now I need you to go and Vogue in the corner for 45 minutes. I just imagine you being a beauty queen is hysterical. I could have. I have the mentality to be a... Yeah, you're already a diva. No one's a diva. You are a diva. I per se- I come off as if... How you- about you... Do you know what I am? Do you know what I am? Dude, don't ever speak to me in that tone again. No, you have this... You feel like you have this, like, my shit... <laughs> I'll you- tell the editor to cut your mic and post right now. <laughs> yeah, I feel like you, like... I don't know why I have this my shit doesn't stink attitude when you have a Glade plug-in in every room of your house that smells like your shit. Like it's, it's mainly because you can't wipe either. So it's yeah. literally your shit. You yeah. stand up when you wipe. You look like that. Shit. You eat boneless wings and you stand up when you wipe. That's how, well, the type look. of guy that you are. Asshole. You eat boneless wings and you look, stand up when you wipe. I take a lot of slander. I take yeah. a lot of slander from yeah. you. I take a lot of shit. Yeah. Don't you ever say I eat boneless wings in my own you, house. You, He's you, not even mad about standing up wiping. He's like, don't you ever look. Me. I know I don't wipe with the best of them. Yeah. <laughs> You wipe in the shower, and you eat boneless wings while you do it. You drink light beer, eat boneless wings. You've never had a shower leg? You've never had a shower leg. What do you mean? Where I've wiped my ass in the shower? No, it's when you take a medium leg into the shower, and you're like, I can really taste That's this. That's disgusting. Oh, yeah, you're just eating. You have a rotisserie. Like a shower beer. You're shower, a shower beer? Yeah, yeah like, you never had a, a whole rotisserie just ne- going? No, a shower wing? No. Bro, there's nothing better than, like, the water is, like, medium to high temperature, and the wing is just suicidal. Like, you're just sweating. Dude, do you know what I imagine? I imagine you in a bathtub, sitting there with a floating plate of wings, you just eating them, and then someone taking a photo and going back in time and showing a racist in the 50s and being like, this is what we're afraid of. Like, this is why we need to do what we're doing, okay? We can't have this. I am, in all honesty, and I... I'm going to wrap it up after this bit that we'll see if it works. It won't. I am the epitome of what people in the 50s were afraid of. They were like, we don't want these guys running in, smashing out our daughters, and producing these weird... Getting all of our D1 football scholarships (laughs) just to tear an ACL and become a funny bunny comedian. If I have to go cheer for Dimitri because, you know, his dad fucked my sister, I'm going to be very sad about it. Great bit. Um... You can go take your... You, you, <laughs> so funny. <laughs> so funny. <All> right. <laughs> never mind. I'll never preface anything as this is might be a bit. Epic. Yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah. It's, Don't do that. Yeah, it's hysterical. Aldo, you want to bring some funny to this, bud? I have a show on August 19th. <laughs> Moroccan <Maraki Tava Bar. laughs> Uh You should come on out. I will be hosting. Glendon McGee will be headlining. Thank you very much. All right, I, guess, I guess we're doing dates. Let's wrap it up. All right. Plug your dates. I am going to be... Oh, it is upon us. Within the next eight days, August 18th through the 22nd, I'm going to be at JP's Comedy Club having fun, kissing boys, kissing girls, kissing babies, trying to run for mayor. And also, guys, bet you didn't know, S'mores Day. S'mores Day. Everyone go out, get a s'more, enjoy it with your family that you have. The family that loves you and enjoys you and is good to you. Uh, Herbert Hoover Day. Shout out, Hooves. (laughs) <laughs> um, world vlogging day sit down talk about your life who touched you at summer camp I'd love to know uh, national or he said s'mores um, shapewear day you should get that you tubby bitch um, <laughs> how, uh, many more, how many more are we doing dude world lion day because I am an alpha head of the pride <laughs> <laughs> alright and this comes out when the the 10th, 10th. Uh, I already have your dates set up oh shit there I am um, okay here we go DPG and Friends, first Wednesday every month. The next one's going to be in September. It's going to be a good time. House of Comedy, first Wednesday is going to be a good time. Also, this one's on the 10th. So the 11th, 12th, 13th, I'm in Northern Arizona. The 11th is Prescott. The 12th is Payson. And the 13th is, I think that's a Saturday at the Orpheum Theater up there in Old Flagstaff. Do you know Joe Rogan and Hulk Hogan have the same birthday? They both say the N-word. Um, <laughs> yeah, what, what is what did that do for anyone? I was just surprised in Hip Hop Day. Well, their names rhyme, too. Joe it? Rogan, Hulk Hogan. Yep. Oh, man. That's dope. It is pretty cool. Hell, yeah. 
Or are you going to be celebrating like Joe Rogan's birthday, <laughs> Andrew? I, I, yeah, cut, yeah. Oh, Andrew, are you up. are you done? Yeah, I'm done. Okay, cool. Andrew, what are you doing? Uh, I'm going to be. I, I have my monthly show every third Wednesday of the month. Uh, it's going to be August 17th at Coop's Bar and Grill, uh, and then we're going to be at the Perch with Aldo on August 18th. That's all I got. Ooh. And also, he's going to be the boys will be at my JP shows. Bye. <laughs> All right, yeah. Peace it's done. Out. Bye. Bye.